hello hello and welcome to my community wow i'm so happy to have you on here today again to watch this video i know you're excited to hear what i'm about to say and i am excited that you're watching this video to my new subscribers Ooh, I I really, really, really appreciate it. Thank you. Thank you for growing this little community. You can see we are growing drip by drip, little by little. Thank you so much. To my returning subscribers, you guys are the real MVPs. You are the bomb. Thank you for growing this community. This community is ours to build and is ours to grow. Thank you so much. Right, so today... I am sharing something that you all want to hear. But before I get into that, I'm going to tell you my name. And my name is Jane Samson. And this is Janie's Hub. This is my community where I share about my journey relocating to the United Kingdom, my life in the UK. As most of you know, I recently relocated to the United Kingdom via the skilled worker visa where I got a job as a healthcare worker into the UK. How amazing is that? So today I'll be sharing something that most of you really want to know, um, current um, agencies or companies that are currently rec recruiting. I have gotten tons of emails. I see your emails. I, I, I really appreciate you taking out time to, you know, to write to me. Uh, unfortunately, I'm not be able to respond to all your emails because I really have limited time to myself, but I will do my best to respond. Guys, you are welcome. Now, I really want to start by saying this to everybody. I've seen your emails, I've seen your comments, and I'm saying that this healthcare visa is free. It is free. So, and unfortunately, like you all would expect, a lot of people are using this avenue now to scam people. People are being scammed. And I'm saying to you, beware. Be very, very beware. Be careful. The UK has made this open. It is the duty of the employer to sponsor you. So they pay to the UK government to bring you into the UK. It is not your duty to go paying anybody. So anybody asking you for exorbitant fees, I am telling you it is a scam. So beware. You can do this by yourself. Yes, I know it has gotten competitive. It has gotten, you know, it's gotten out so much competitive. A lot of people are jumping into it. But if you take your time and commit to it, I if you watch my last videos, you see how long it took me. It might take you some time, but if you take the steps you're meant to take, get all your documents, you will definitely get there. Do all you can do this by yourself. If you want to get go to an agency. Ensure it is the right agency you're going to go online, do your research. I mean, cross all your T's and dot all your I's and you see you're walking on the right path. Having said that, right, I'm not going to jump into this video today, all right, of companies that are currently recruiting. Like, I am not just giving you any company. I am giving you company that contacted me. Now, in the course of my search while I was um, applying for jobs, if you watch my previous videos, I said there were days I sent out as much as 30 emails. Yes, as much as to some of you come into my um, inbox, you're saying, oh, I'm tired of applying. I've not gotten any response. It's always unfortunately. I got so many. I mean, hundreds of unfortunately as well. But I did not stop. Like I keep saying, do not stop applying until you have gotten your certificate of sponsorship in your hands. All right. Now, some of those companies I actually applied to, some of them are actually getting back to me. In fact, the week I was to arrive in the UK, one of them um, got back to me. I just ignored it. Now they've gotten back to me again to say, oh, Jane, are you still interested in this opportunity? Please send us your email again. Tell us when to give you an interview. And I thought, well, the best thing to do is to share it with you guys. All right. But the first thing I'm going to do is to say to you guys, the best way to go about this application, instead of applying to the vacancies online where everybody's, you know, one app, one vacancy come up and over 10,000 people are applying for it. My best advice is to go on the UK sponsorship list. There are, there's a list of companies that sponsor, that have the right to sponsor people into the UK. Go there and look for those and look, go to their website. That's what I did. I was I was sending in cold emails, cold emails to this company. So I just sent in my code cover letter. I sent in my CV. I sent in my certificates. I am ready to be sponsored. A lot of them I don't have vacancies at the moment, 
But the truth is, in the next one month, in the next two months, because people keep leaving, people are looking for bigger opportunities, people are looking for better companies, they might have vacancies. And that is why I got the emails that I got. I hope you understand. So the first point of call is to go to the UK sponsorship list, the companies, the companies that have the right to sponsor from overseas. Look for companies that are looking for healthcare workers. Not all of them are looking for, some are just looking for nurses, some are just looking for doctors, some are looking for physiotherapists. So look for those who, has, who are looking for healthcare assistance. Even if they're not currently recruiting, send them a cold email, attach your CV, tell them that you're currently ready, you have all your documents ready to be employed you know, whenever they are ready. That's what I did. So I'm going to put the link of the um the, of, the, of the UK sponsorship list in the in the in the description. So you click on it and take your time. That there, there are hundreds of them. There are so many. Take your time, craft code emails and send to them. And before you know it, you see that that is how I, even the job I got. I can't remember applying to them. I can't remember seeing the vacancy anywhere. It was from one of the cold emails that I sent that they contacted me and said, are you ready to be interviewed? That is how I got my current job. Yes, that's the truth. And I'm saying that to you today. All right. So take your time. Sit down. It's, it's taxing. It's demanding. But it's worth it at the end. Some of us are just looking for short corners or looking for who will do it forever. Looking for who will give us a list. Well, that is where you end up falling into trouble. I am saying to you today, go. I'm going to put the link in the description. Go through the list one by one. Look for those. When you click on one of the lists, put it in a new in a new table and go through their website and see that they are recruiting currently. Now, for the companies that have gotten back to me, I have three. I have three in the last couple of weeks that have gotten back to me, and it is your best interest to apply to them as soon as you can. And please, when you get a job, when you get a sponsorship, make sure you come back to me to share your good news. I'll be so happy to share. All right. So the first company is Kmark. Yes, I know it's a popular one. A lot of people has um, you know, talked about Kmark, but the truth is they are a very big company. They are so big that they are almost over 40 communities in the UK. They have homes, they have homes everywhere. They have um, their homes all over, scattered all over the UK. So they are always recruiting. I got an email to the, uh, from them about two days ago. Yes, yeah, just two days ago to say, oh, we see that you sent us an email some time ago to say you're interested. Are you still interested? This is what was sent to me. So I'm saying to you, go to Kmark now. Ensure you have all your documents ready. If you don't have all your documents ready, it's almost a waste of time. Have all your documents ready. You know, draft a very good cover letter, make your CV the UK standard format and let it fit into the job description of what you are applying for. All right. And then send to them. So it's Kmark. I'll have it on the screen and I'll have their link in the description below. That's the, the first company, Kmark. All right. Go to their website. Now, there are so many fake websites that are prompt, um, popping up. Whatever you do, make sure you go to the company's website, go to the about page, go to their careers page, go to everything about them, go to uh, work for us or working for us. Click on this, um, on this, um, section and see, make sure that they, it is stated on their website. So whatever YouTube channel you go to and they say, oh, this company is recruiting, do your own research. Guys, please do not fall into anybody's scam. Do your own due diligence. You right? So that's the first company. The second company, this is the company that contacted me a few days after I was to leave, you know, into the UK and I just ignored it. But they contacted me again, I think it was last week, and they said, oh, we're waiting for you to send us your um, your interview, the date for you to be interviewed. And it's called Brunel Care. Brunel Care. I'm, I'm going to put it in the description in the caption below and I'll ask you guys to go and check it out because they are they send me email twice. I'm sure they're looking for people, all right? So ensure you have all your documentations ready. Second company, they also have organizations all over the UK. Now, the last company is Oakham Grange. Oakham Grange. Don't worry, I'm going to put the right link in the comment section. Do your own due diligence. Search for the company by yourself. Go through all the sections. Write a fantastic cover letter. Go online and search how to write a cover letter. Search how to draft your CV and send to the um, company. Guys, this whole process has got very, very competitive. You need to put your best foot forward. You need to put your best foot forward. When I mean putting your best foot forward, you need to you know, have an edge over others. Guys, these are the three companies that I know right now that are currently recruiting. And I'm saying to you, putting your best, putting your best foot forward. And I cannot wait to share your good news. Guys, if you have not um, thought of subscribing, if you have not subscribed 
what are you waiting for we need to grow this community we need to get this community to the point that hmm it becomes like a global community let's grow this community share this video share it to your friends subscribe like put on your notification i've got so much to share i've got growing i've got so much to share from my experience and right now we have come to the end of this video i'll see you guys sooner than you expected make sure you subscribe take care of yourself and i can't wait to share your good news bye bye